It's our favorite time of the morning. Debbie is here because it's yeah. Sunday. She is here to show us how to make a lamp using copper. Yes. These are really cool and I love the Edison bulb. This you know, is very in. It is in. It's very, you know, urban, very modern, fun, mm -hmm. and easy. You know, it's something that anybody can do. You know, I don't know if a lot of people know, but we do sell these um, make a lamp kit uh, packages at Home Depot. And then we sell the parts in be, uh, individually as well. Huh. For this lamp, you just need the cord and the uh, receptacle, but the make a uh, Lamp kit is great if you're going to make it. You can make a lamp out of anything, a cowboy boot, a bottle, a vase, you know, any vessel you can make into a lamp, believe it or not. I never thought about making my own lamp, but <laughs> you, of right. course, have. <laughs> of course. <laughs> so I chose to make it out of copper, and this is half-inch copper pipe from our plumbing department. Mm -hmm. And copper... Um, can turn and oxidize. So if you want that rustic look, you can let it just evolve as in its natural state. Or you can, when it's all together, before you uh, wire it, you might want to hit it with a top coat or the clear flex seal, and that will secure the shiny copper finish. So just a little thought. Now this is a six foot copper pipe, and this is what we're gonna use. One of these, which is about under $15, I believe, can make one whole lamp. Oh, okay. So, and then you're gonna cut all the pieces. So you'll need a copper cutter. Now the copper cutter is very easy. Ooh. And um, that, all you have to do is you measure and mark it with the, uh, with, usually I use a Sharpie or a, a permanent marker so it doesn't rub off. And then you're just going to put it inside the thing right here, you turn the knob to tighten where the cutter is, and then all you're gonna do is wheel it around like this, tighten as you go, and then a few turns, and oh, it really cuts nice, right? So That actually kinda looks fun to do. It is fun, and you're gonna use nine pieces of copper uh, for this lamp. So this one I made so the bulb is uh, facing up, and this one, the bulb hangs down. So depending on the decor that you want mm -hmm. or the look that you want, you can do either or. And then you're just going to put your pieces together. And to do that, for this project, we're gonna use six elbows, a T, and two caps, and then the pipe, and then the lamp kit. So, and that's all you need for this whole project. Can you buy this? The, yes. All of that So together. what we're going to do, these either come in a package of 10 or you can buy them individually. This only needs six, but the package of 10 is less than if you buy six individual, you know what I'm saying? So, and if you're making multiple lamps, then the, the package is good. And then the caps and the tees uh, either come in bulk or individual. And you only need one T and two caps, so I would just buy those individual. Once you uh, have all your copper cut, and I'll have all the sizes um, for everybody, you're just gonna assemble it. And to start, you know, we just have a cap, and then you're just gonna push it all together. Now, once it's all put together, um, we're gonna wire it um, in the next segment Ooh. to show you how to make it a lamp. And I'm gonna have all the instructions on my Home Depot Debbie Facebook page and on Instagram. And you can see here, it works beautifully and it's very simple. And I just wanna show you, you wanna wire it first and then we're going to secure the copper because it doesn't stay together by itself. So we're gonna use hot glue or you know, any type of clear glue to secure the copper. But it's really fun, really exciting, and again, I'll have all the instructions for everybody. I've seen these lamps do something similar in like the fancy, you know, Crate and Barrel Absolutely. and West Elm and stuff like that. So you're helping us to make it. Wonderful. A little DIY <laughs> uh, right. for a lot less. Thanks, De <laughs> Depot. Depot <laughs> Debbie. Forgot the home. <laughs> Depot That's Debbie, right. everybody. Uh, we'll see you in the 8 o'clock hour as we Sounds finish good. up this lamp. Very good. <laughs> all righty. We're going to be in summer, you know, before we know it. Yeah. But it is funny to talk about summer and all of that. But you got to get hired soon and go through the training and all that to be a lifeguard. So That's we it. have got Home Depot Debbie here. She's talking about what you could do in your home. And we're making these cool lamps yep. out of copper pipes. That's it. So earlier we talked about how to make the structure of the lamp with copper pipe and cutting it. And um, I posted all the... Um, increments and all the directions on uh, my Home Depot Debbie Facebook page and Instagram, but now we're going to talk about wiring it. So it's very simple. So here we have um, a make your own lamp kit and as we talked about earlier, you could really make a lamp out of anything. And if you choose, the lamp kit works great. But for these lamps that I'm showing here today, you really just need the cord and the socket. So 
Either one will work, but you could choose cost, which one you want. You the one, save a the money. one reason I like getting the individual um, stuff is because this is a clear cord, and this one comes with a white cord. I'm wiring this one with a white cord just so you could see. But you can see our finished one here has the clear cord, and it kind of works nicely, even though you're going to tuck it away with the Edison bulb. So it's kind of just an aesthetic you choose. So once you have all your pieces cut, you're going to assemble the lamp the structure like of uh -huh. it. Then you're going to release the pieces that you need to put the wire through. So for example, on this one, the wire comes in the back and goes up, over, and down, and come up. So you don't need to disassemble the side pieces. This one, it's just going to come in the side and go up. So I disassembled these pieces right here, and then I pulled the cord through about as long as I needed, but then you're going to pull it back once you put them together. Then once you get this ready, you're just going to feed the cord through the copper pipe and through the elbows and through everything. And you'll see here, it'll come out the other end eventually. <laughs> there, we there we go. And then we're gonna pull it through. And you're just gonna keep feeding through the pieces and then you're going to get to the end. Once you get to the end, and just in the interest of time, I'm gonna show you what we do next. This is the socket. The socket comes in silver and gold. I spray painted it copper to go with the copper piping. But you know, this could be any color you want. You can spray paint the whole thing black. You could do like matte black, you which could. is it, or anything you like could. that. When you do the socket, the metal piece comes, slides up, then it's got a cardboard protector, and then you have the socket piece that has the electrical. You're gonna split the cord. You're going to make a U shape with the top wires, like so. And then you're going to hook them around the screws. Now, there's a grooved side and a smooth side. Grooved goes to silver, smooth goes to gold. Once you hook them on, you just tighten the screws. You're gonna slide the cup, the back through the socket, and then this is the bottom, goes right on here. And you can see here, this fits perfectly in half inch pipe, so we didn't need any type of connector. So it worked out really well in terms of sizes. Once you get this all together, you're going to pull the cord back through, and then I just took a glue gun. You can use clear adhesive, and you're just gonna put a little dollop of glue right in the edge and stick it together so it doesn't fall apart. Again, I'll have all this information on my Home Depot Debbie Facebook and Instagram. Light up your life, make your own oh, lamp, wait. and have a great day. Okay, there we'll see you, you at go. Nine. Ooh. <laughs>